Extravasation Management Extravasation is the inadvertent infiltration of vesicant drugs into tissues. Signs and symptoms of extravasation include pain, irritation, warmth, and erythema. If extravasation is suspected, stop the infusion immediately and do not flush the line. You must first attempt to aspirate as much medication as possible from the site while the IV cannula or access device is still in place. Once aspiration is performed, remove the present cannula or access device. Assess the patient and the site thoroughly, making note of measurements, edema, and or erythema. Contact the provider immediately for an antidote order utilizing the policy table references. Refer to table on page four of banner policy 13218, management guidelines for the treatment of the extravasation of antineoplastic medication. You can also use ONS resources. When ready, administer antidotes as ordered. Elevate the affected area and apply warm or cold compresses as appropriate. To determine whether to apply a warm or cold compress to the site, refer back to policy 13218 or our ONS resources. As a general guideline, remember that topical application of cold packs is recommended for extravasation of almost all vesicant and irritant drugs, excluding the vinca alkaloids such as vincristine or vinblastine and the epidophilotoxins such as etoposide. Intermittent cooling is thought to cause vasoconstriction, thereby diminishing the spread of the drug and the extent of the local injury. It also reduces local inflammation and pain. Application of ice is contraindicated for extravasation of vinca alkaloids or the epi epidophilotoxins as cold may increase the ulceration caused by these drugs. Instead, the application of heat is recommended for these agents. Local heating is thought to help increase blood flow, thereby enhancing drug removal. After nursing interventions are complete, be sure to document the procedure and the patient's record and complete an event report. Notify leadership as soon as possible and notify risk management within 24 hours.